Okay, glasses, tell me the way to the next supermarket. Would you talk to your spectacles? If it was up to Amazon, we'd all be doing that pretty soon. Amazon recently introduced Echo Frames, smart glasses that basically offer Alexa on the go. Other big tech players like Facebook are investing in intelligent eyewear too. Smart glasses seem to be the next big thing. So what concepts are already out there? What are Amazon's and Facebook's new products? And how do the companies benefit? Let's have a look. Only five years ago, the concept smart glasses for everybody seemed dead. In January 2015, Google officially stopped selling its controversial Google Glass to the public. The device featured a technology that can display information directly in the user's field of vision. It also had a camera. I got to try out one in 2014. The experience was far from perfect, but fascinating. Apart from technical problems, the product sparked a lot of criticism for potentially violating privacy laws. The idea of being recorded without noticing freaked out a lot of people. As a result, people who used the device got nicknamed glass holes in the US. Google had to backpedal, but kept on developing smart spectacles for professional users. Taking a similar approach, Microsoft has successfully been working on smart glasses for quite some time without causing a public outcry. Their HoloLens is supposed to help with all kinds of work processes, from engineering to assisting with medical surgeries to architectural designs. It's only available for companies. Now, let's have a look at the latest development. Apart from Amazon, Facebook is another big player pushing for a smart glasses technology for everyday use. They presented their project Orion in September. Facebook's glasses are basically designed to replace smartphones. While they're still at an early stage of development, Facebook has a wide range of functions in mind. The glasses will allow users to take calls, show information in a small display, and even live stream what they see to their social media friends and followers. So it's taking Google's initial approach with Glass a step further. Facebook is also developing an AI voice assistant to help operate the glasses. They expect it to be ready for general use in 2023, only a couple of years from now. Compared to Project Orion, Amazon's Echo Frames have rather limited functions. The glasses are connected to a phone. For now, that's only Android devices. They can read out notifications, make phone calls and play audio. You can also ask Alexa for rundowns of your calendar, the news, the weather and the usual things. Doesn't sound too exciting. But Alexa's AI software could have its advantages. As an always-on voice assistant, it could give you suggestions to improve your day-to-day -day interactions. If Alexa knows you're meeting a colleague, for instance, it can remind you to ask about a project you're both involved with. And the Echo Frames have a big advantage over Facebook's device. Theoretically, they're already available. In the US, that is. You have to apply for an invitation, though. And if you're lucky, they'll cost you 180 euros. The basic idea is to make the company's services accessible to the user in the easiest way possible. Facebook's and Amazon's bet is, if we don't have to switch on our smartphones first, we'll use their services more often. So it's not really about selling hardware, it's about optimizing their business model. Facebook is collecting and analyzing user data to sell targeted ads. With their glasses, they get even closer to their users. Firstly, the amount of data they can collect becomes a lot bigger. With video footage and audio recordings that could contain sensitive information. That could make tailored ads much more precise. And secondly, there are new possibilities of showing these ads. Imagine you're walking past a supermarket. Suddenly, an ad for minced meat pops up in your field of vision because you've searched the internet for a pasta sauce recipe before. Convenient or terrifying? Amazon is collecting and analyzing user data to sell from their online shopping universe. They want to profit the same way as Facebook. With customers using Alexa more often, Amazon will get a much better idea of what they are likely to buy and place ads accordingly. Honestly, this sounds like the ultimate privacy nightmare to me.
both Facebook and Amazon have recently assured that they will place a greater focus on security and privacy in the future, but their smart glasses projects make me think that they were just paying lip services to this issue. What do you think of smart glasses? Would you use them? And if so, which functions would you wish for? Let us know in the comments. And if you have a digital topic you would like us to cover, let us know as well. Hope you enjoyed this video. Bye-bye.